Frank Morrell out there. We want to know what in the world was that all about. Where does it your place to come out here, kick the king in the head, and do all of that? Hey, let me tell you something, Lance Russell. I was through refereeing for the night, and I looked up. What the tape didn't show, Jeff Jarrett purposely drop-kicked Frank Morrell, and Frank, you know, he's the only living person that's actually older than Eddie Marlin, has a heart attack right in the middle of the ring, and I run out there to save Frank's life to give him CPR, and on my referee instincts, okay, I drop down to count. And at that moment, I'd also seen Lola Powell drive Eddie Gilbert. You forget about that. That was on the tape. At that moment, all the months and months of Jerry Lawler's flagrant disregard for the rules, with flagrant disregard for authority, he has pushed me around, he has shoved me. And I tell you what, Lance, I just wasn't going to stand for it anymore. I couldn't take it. I was disgusted, and so I stomped him like the cockroach that he is. Let me tell you that. You took it upon yourself to do it. Jerry Lawler has Eddie Gilbert down. You, as a referee, step in there, take it upon yourself, kick him and cause a loss of the match in there, count him out. Now, where do you get off doing something like that? Oh, boy, this is surprising that you're taking Lawler's side. Well, when you left in 89, it wasn't to go to Atlanta. It was to run the Jerry Lawler fan club full All time. Right. Everybody Don't knows that. Don't with that smart stuff in you here. Should be, I stood up to Jerry Lawler, and he couldn't stand it. Did you see him? He was like all bug-eyed. He was so shocked that a referee actually fought back. Well, let me tell you something, Lawler. It's going to happen again if you come out and mess with me. Well, it isn't going to happen with you because I wish you would listen to this little announcement. Eddie Marlin couldn't be here today, but he told me what he wanted to pass on to Scott Bowden. If you're listening, Eddie Marlin says you are suspended. Your job is out. You're suspended. Oh, you stand here and say for what? That's the jury, Lawler. What? Because you kicked him in the head. You took a place that had no record. This is a perfect example of how Lawler's got the promotion in his back pocket. You understand me? What did I do? Let me tell you one thing, young did man. Did Lawler pal drop him? You bet. Listen, that doesn't have did anything Lawler to do with it. But suspension is... Yeah, you never missed anything. I, he's suspended, and that's all there is to it. And you better learn one thing right now. In this life, you pay. You have to take the responsibility for okay, your Dad. act. Okay, Dad. I cannot believe I have stood back here and heard you actually say that. Eddie Marlin told you to suspend this That's young true. man after he did what we told all of our young people to do. Stand up for yourself. Stand up for yourself. After all those years, Jerry Calhoun referee in here let Lord get by with murder. Then Frank Morrell, Paul Neighbors, the list goes on and on and on. But when somebody fights back, you suspend them. This man, this man will have to stand on the street corner now with a sign saying, I'll referee for money. See, he doesn't have a job. You yeah, suspended him now. He has no job. This poor... What am I going to do in a position now? where you would take a wrestler? I don't know. What I don't know. Do? Well, I'll tell you what, buddy. You've got a friend in me, and I'll find you something to do. Oh, Come yeah, on. yeah. Eddie Gilbert's my best friend now. You understand that? Let me tell you something, Jerry Lawler. You haven't heard the last of me. When you least expect it, expect it, Lawler, okay? Eddie Gilbert's my best friend. You haven't friend. learned anything if Eddie Gilbert is your best friend, because I'll tell you, people judge you by the folks you hang out with. Scott Bowden, we're going to be back in a moment. Oh, man, filling somebody's mind. By, hey, what is this across the way? Scott Bowden. Bowden throws powder right in 